Right, so today we're going to be picking this 11 disc baton, disc detainer. As you can see the front disc spins freely here, so you can't tension from the front using a tool like this. You have to tension from the rear. So you could use a tool like this, but as you can see there's teeth on here, so you need profiling. And if you wanted to cut profiling into this tool, there's not enough material between the centre shaft and the edge of the pick head here. Um, so you can't do that. You can get Chinese disc detainer picks that look a bit like this but tension from the rear but you can't use those because this pick head's too fat and so if you have a situation like what we can see at the front of the lock here where one disc needs to be at 90 degrees to the disc behind it or in front of it and this picking head is too fat you have to jostle at least one of the discs to get onto the next one which can move it out of position obviously so let's get this picked uh, for all the special people out there who think I'm hiding something in, in the vice here underneath look, here's the lock here's the lock, you can see I'm not hiding anything because someone actually said that I think the less said about that the better so here's my tool it's rear tensioning, it's got the profile out of the picking head and the tensioner and Let's try and get this lock picked. I don't ever remember seeing this lock being picked. A lot of people say it's unpickable. But uh surely isn't. Right. Let's move it down to there. Let's go. So what I'm gonna do here is tension the lock. And I'm just gonna go through the pack for binding discs and if I don't feel it binding I'm just going to park it around at the zero position the annoying thing about this tool like lots of my disc designer prototypes is the fact that the picking head slips off the disc really easily when you're trying to turn it like that, it gets very frustrating. So a finished tool, you wouldn't have that. You'd have like a detent or a clicker to stop that from happening. We know this front free spinner can go at zero, so we know where that one lives. Okay, so now I'm just going to go back through the pack again. So this is good, I can feel the sidebar starting to bite down harder onto the discs. Which means you're getting somewhere. Okay, that's really close now. Frustrating tool slippage. Oh, there we go. She's picked. So, just so you can see the rear there. Spin it. Okay, let's get her gutted. discs, there's the front tree floater, there's no notch, let's just dump the pack. Let's give them a 
nice spread around so they're all visible there. A sea of discs, and that's it, bat on disc detainer picked.